Greetings, friends, and welcome to Beast Foundry. My name is Christian, and as usual, I will be your guide today. You know what, Italo? Just stop the intro. We don't really have time for that today. This was the most monumental day in gaming that I have witnessed in my 30 years of playing role-playing games with thousands of others we watched with bated breath waiting for Wizards of the Coast to release the announcement of their draconian changes to the open gaming license never came, got canceled. You know, right beforehand, a email was released telling people that the only thing Wizards is going to listen to is canceling their D&D Beyond subscriptions. And man, that was heard because Wizards site crashed some speculation said that it may have been done intentionally to remove the unsubscribe button so that it became harder to unsubscribe. I have no idea. After all of that, there was then an announcement by Paizo announcing what they are creating an open game license that is going to be called Orc. Open role playing game. Oh God, I don't even know at the moment. I'm just too excited. But they are. They have been silent through most of this, just saying, you know, we're waiting to see what's going on. And today's announcement was honestly spectacular. And you guys can search Paizo Orc online if you don't know what's going on. I can't imagine that's possible, but if you don't, check it out. But it is truly, you know, it's one of those moments that that's what we live for in these games is this heroic standing up against bullies, against tyrants, and saying, you know, we're not gonna be pushed around and we're not gonna allow you to push around other people. Oh, it made my day. And I originally wanted to do a quick little video about our uh, new projects for the upcoming year. So in all honesty, it kind of goes hand in hand with some of this that's going on. Uh, we're going to be starting a graphic novel uh, featuring our world of Chandara. Uh, that's going to be coming out very soon. So please keep an eye out for that. And also, uh, we are going to be creating our own game system. I'm not going to say anything about it yet, but that is one of the things I really hope to... It takes a long time to do something like that. It is not, oh, look, here's going to be a book out this year. But I'm getting the core concepts down. I am going to be getting the rules down. I'm going to be asking for play testers. I'm going to be trying out new things. Now, please don't think this in any way means that I'm moving away from Pathfinder. Nothing could be further from the truth. But I want to kind of have you know, Beast Foundry to have its own voice in some way. And, you know, it'll probably never be anything huge, but I don't know. Nobody knows. And you have to just, you know, follow your heart sometimes. Also, you know, I have an amazing group of employees that are helping me. They are wonderful people. I can't express to you in words how I feel about this wonderful group. They are all Brazilians. They are helping me achieve my dreams and you know one of the things i want to do to give back is i want to create a system that is fun but also very affordable to you know people in brazil and some of those areas where the currency exchange rate is awful and you know sometimes for them to look at a book and buy it at our currency level that's a $300 book. No one's buying that. So, you know, of course they, they pirate them because they have no other choice or you know, lots of things. So I want to give back to my friends. And I also I'm aware that, you know, there's a very vibrant gaming community down there. And I want to do what I can to support that and help that and bring everyone to the table. And it doesn't matter what game you're playing. I want everyone to have fun. And, you know, what I witnessed today just really solidified my idea. I was wavering about it for a while. Like, should I, should I not? But honestly, after today, things are different. The, you know, everything's going to be different moving forward and we don't even know what it looks like. But, you know, it's it's interesting times and oh, such an awesome day. So anyways, that's all I have for you guys today. Please like and subscribe. If you want to keep up with what we've got going on, you can check out Beast Foundry on Instagram. 
If you want to support us, please head to the Patreon and support us. We're doing a lot of great work. There is a ton of stuff there. We have all for Pathfinder, second edition. We have ancestries. We have classes. We have archetypes. Well, not plural classes. There's just one class. Uh, we have animal companions, tons of monsters. We have equipment. There is a lot of stuff there for you. And check it out if you want. You can look at the other videos to see some of the stuff that's going on there. But that's all I have for you guys this week. So as usual, game well, my friends.